the Experience Pros Radio Show, home of the original Fan Bragging Fridays. Take just 20 seconds to become a revolutionary by sharing a fan bragging story of great customer service on Facebook.com slash Experience Pros. Now, back to Angel and Eric, the Experience Pros. Hey, does telling your story so that it gets heard, understood, and remembered sometimes feel like Mission Impossible? Then Jerry Brown of Jerry Brown PR can help. Jerry's here on the Experience Pros Radio Show at this time every week with a tip to help you tell your story. Welcome back, Jerry. Thanks. It's good to be here. What's our storytelling tip this week? It is to repeat yourself. Repeat yourself? What is it? Could I repeat that? <laughs> that? If you want to be remembered, you should repeat yourself. We should repeat yourself? Absolutely. All right. I, and do it often. Wow. You know, if you've ever been a speechwriter, as I have been, or if you've done a lot of speaking, and I know that both of you have done that, I've done some of that as well, you've probably heard the whole thing about, you know, tell them what you're going to tell them, tell them, and then tell them what, what you, you told, told them. And yeah. it's all about repeating yourself. And the question is, well, why would you do that? And, and, and this sounds like hyperbole, but it's not. Your audience... Oh, what? Hyperbole. That's exaggeration. Oh, that. Yeah, yeah go that. Ahead. But if you... Your audience is going to forget 90% of what you tell them within a few hours, and they're going to actually forget most of what you've told them very quickly after you're done. So this is probably why uh, song lyrics are repeated over and over and over again. Well, we I don't know if that's the reason, I suppose. In right. the, uh, but but uh, the point is, is that if you have a message that you want people to remember, one of the ways to help them do that is to just re repeat it enough times so that they do. And, in fact, you know, your listeners here in Denver, yeah, they all know who Dealing Doug and um, – Jake Jabs are. Oh, yeah. Every oh, yeah. city has one of those guys who and, wears tights and sells cars. Yeah, I mean, Dylan yeah. Doug, I mean, he, he, he just sits there for 30 seconds or a minute, however long it is, he just yells at you that he's got the cheapest prices. Right. You know, and Jake Jabs sells a lot of furniture. The fact is they're both on TV a lot. And as I say, you cannot live in Denver for any length of time without knowing who both of them are, even though you might want to make fun of their commercials till you're ready to buy a car sure. or furniture. And the reality is, yeah, if you don't live in Denver – you know who they are and that you, you've got one of those people in your city. All right. And you know what? Those are great examples, Jerry, because they do. They repeat, repeat, repeat. You see them time and time again, over and over again, not only themselves, but their message as well. And what we see often is a lot of small business owners and a lot of entrepreneurs want to change their message. Yeah. And, it's, and, and sometimes you do have to change your message. But no, you don't want to change your message for the sake of changing it. I'm reading a very interesting book right now called Brain Rules, and he makes the point in there about one of the ways to reinforce memory is repetition and how important it is to memory. What's the name of the book you're reading? Brain Rules. Fantastic. Uh, yeah, repeat that again. I right? just asked you to repeat it. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> I'm practicing. So, yeah, and so, um, you know, it's like when, you, um, when we were in school and we learned things like math, well, there was a reason why we got those math problems to work out and it's because you can listen to all of the rules about all the things in math class forever but until you have a chance to actually do them and ingrain that into your memory by repeating the addition or the subtraction or the whatever it is you're doing sure. enough times that you remember it you're going to not remember. And I I love it, Jerry. And I think that is a great business tip for today. And I think as business owners, we get bored with our message. But remember to this week's message, repeat yourself. For an article about today's storytelling tip on the, that you hear on the Experience Pros Radio Show, go to Jerry's blog at jerrybrownpr.com. You'll also find an archive of all his storytelling tips that Jerry shares here on the Experience Pros at his website, jerrybrownpr.com. Thanks, Jerry. Thank you. You know, the late journalist, screenwriter, and Denver native Gene Fowler once said, Writing is easy. All you do is sit staring at a blank sheet of paper until drops of blood form on your forehead. Keep your forehead dry and hire Jerry Brown of Jerry Brown PR to help you write your blog posts, social media postings, articles, press releases, PowerPoint presentations, and more. Jerry can also edit what you've already written. Jerry Brown at jerrybrownpr.com. You can reach Jerry at jerry at jerrybrownpr.com or by phone at 303 Five nine four eight zero one six. That's three zero three five nine four. 8016. The Experience Pros are here to help you get your business right. To learn more, visit experiencepros.com. 